everybody. This is Janelle, RKC Certified Chemical Instructor and Primal Move Instructor here, um, the owner of Primal Fitness Pittsburgh. Um, so today on the blog, we're talking about everything that you need to do to kind of get yourself out of some pain that can be radiating into your shoulder, pec muscle, and down to your lat. First thing we're going to uh, discuss here is a uh, type of a release um, technique. Most of you are probably familiar with doing foam roller exercises. Today we're going to get a little bit um, more intense with our release tactics and use something right here, our tennis ball. Um, in order to stretch out and alleviate tension into your pec muscle, what you're actually going to do is you're going to lay flat onto your stomach and place your tennis ball right around where the top of your shoulder is. And literally, you just kind of roll on the tennis ball into your shoulder and down into your chest muscle. This, now that being said, you're going to want to go a little easier with this as, uh, as in comparison to what you would normally do with a foam roller because you will notice that um, you it, it's, go it's going to feel a little bit sore if you have um, a particularly long-standing injury. Um, the other thing you're going to want to do is you can also lay flat on your back with the tennis ball here and just kind of roll into... Um, your scapula area here in order to alleviate tension that's built up into your shoulder. You can even get a little bit higher into your trap muscle too. Um, you want to make sure that you're also breathing during this process and not holding your breath. Otherwise your um, muscles will actually contract more and that's not what you want. You want them to release. So when you're going in to move around and get these knots worked out into your body, just make sure that you're doing some pulse breathing And you're gonna to want to breathe slightly faster if you get a point of uh, serious tension or notice a really big knot. Okay, um, so that's all for that. Next up, we're gonna be discussing um, some other, you know, static stretches and active um, stretches to get you guys out of some pain. Okay, we'll see you up on the next video. Take care.